What's up, YouTube? So check it out, guys. I'm going to do a quick masking tutorial. Real quick. Not going to finish the body today, but I'm just going to do a quick tutorial. So here's how I do it. This is how Ricky Revo does his bodies. So I see what I, I like. You know, I find something I want to do. I'll draw it on a piece of paper. You can trace it if you want. Draw it on a piece of paper. Do it in pencil. Okay, get it like that. Take the pencil after you got your final picture down. Let me make sure I can see you guys. Okay, cool. So you, you get your final picture down. And then when you get it down, you kind of go over it kind of hard. Okay, you push kind of hard. You get it on that. The reason I'm doing this is because, you know, I see a lot of guys, you know, don't get me wrong, if it works for you guys, awesome, use it. But I'll see you guys, they'll tape it to the inside of the body, like so, they'll put it right here like so, they'll tape it just like that, and then they'll go on the outside because you got that protective coating and they'll do it with marker. That, I tried it like that a few times and personally it doesn't work for me, so. So I do it like this, this is, this is just what I do. So like I said, Take this, go over it as hard as you can. Well, not hard. don't go through the paper. You know, you guys know what I mean. Because the reason the reason I'm doing this is because I want to see it on the other side. So you just kind of press hard, go over it. That way we can transfer it to the other side. Because if we leave it like this and we take it and we actually tape it on the body like so, it looks good on this side, right? looks like it should be like that you know that's that's how it should look but if you actually did that and you cut it out like that when you flipped it over it would be backwards so we need to transfer it to the other side let me go ahead and finish this real quick You know, guys, there's a lot of painting tutorials out there, so I'm just doing this just to show you guys how I do it and what works for me. Really, guys, you just need to find what works for you. Paint a bunch of bodies and whatever you like the best, you do for yourself. Like the liquid mask, I tried the liquid mask. I don't like it at all. I like my masking tape. Works great. Can't beat it. So there we go. Flip it to the other side. Take another piece of paper, put it underneath it so you can see it. Can't really see through black. So you see that. You guys not, might not be able to see it, but I can. So I'm actually going to take my marker and go over it. There we go. Killers. Now, flip the body, and another thing, it's good because you did it on both sides, because you could flip it, and you could still see it, so you can get your placement just right. Okay, so you find a spot you like, get it where you need it, and then we're going to tape it to the body. There we go. Flip it over. Lay down your tape. You guys see that? Check it out. See how you can see right through it? See that? Now, just transfer the pattern. You could either do it with a pencil, you could do it with whatever, pencil, marker, whatever works for you. I think I'm going to do that one with a marker. This I did here with a pencil because it's kind of straight lines and real sharp looking. I mean, there's a couple of spots where I need to correct a few things, but... That one's, I kind of needed as straight as possible, so I used the pencil on that one, very thin line, so. This one's kind of more of a, this is going to be like blood, so it doesn't need to be perfect letters, so I'm going to go over it with the, uh, the Sharpie, so. Yeah, kind of jagged lines. There you go. Can you still see it? Awesome. 
Do that, killers. Yeah. the light back. Oh, there goes Wolverine. It's alright Logan, I got you buddy. Don't worry. Put him back. See? There we go. Now I'm going to cut that out. Let me see if I can get a zoom in on this. All right. <clears throat> uh, right here. See this little guy right here hanging off? This little piece of tape hanging off right here? Now, if you leave that there, you will see it when you paint the car. So any of that little stuff there, you just want to go up to, take your X-Acto knife, go right along the line, and just scrape it away. There you go. See that? So let's peel this off and see how it looks. As I drop my camera here. There we go. All right, let's peel it off. Let's see how it looks over here. Oh, check that out. <laughs> how cool does that look? Very cool, huh? So you just leave, this is how I do it. I do all the I essentially make my own masks and I just put them on there like that and I leave them on there until I'm ready to take them off and do the uh, the color they're gonna be. Now this one is not gonna be double lined. The the Iron Maiden, I'm actually gonna have to uh, recut it again. Actually, I got to do really thin lines all the way around everything because the inside is gonna be white. But the outline border is going to be red. So that, I'm actually going to cut the inside out when I do all my white. You see, we're going to have Eddie up top, too. That, that right there, dude. Ugh, guys, I don't know. This is probably one of the toughest bodies I've ever had to do. I'm going to give it a whirl. I'm going to see if I can make it work. I think I can make it work. I'm going to make it work. So, But there you go. Just leave that on there until you're ready to put the color you want it to be on there. And you're good to rock and roll guys that's it that's how ricky revo does his paint jobs thanks for watching guys catch you later